Hey everybody, it's Reed Puser here. And Robin Gerlach. With the Roots Home Sales Team and Remax Alliance. We're here to chat with you guys a little bit today about uh, some stats uh, from December 2019 and comparing those to the stats in December 2018 um, in hopes of getting you good, some good information in regards to how you can plan and be effective in 2020 with your real estate decisions. So we looked at three different statistics from December 2019, comparing them to December 2018. And uh, they were the amount of homes for sale, so inventory in our market, um, and then how many homes actually sold, so the amount of transactions from year to year, and then the median price, and if that went up or down. So um, it was uh, pretty staggering. So the amount of homes for sale or available inventory uh, in December 2019 was 27.5% less than what we saw in December 2018. Uh, however, the amount of transactions went up 18%. Um, so part of that is due to low mortgage rates. Um, mortgage rates have remained pretty low. They're lower than about a percentage point lower than what they were in 2018. Um, low unemployment and wages are growing here, so we have favorable economic conditions. So home buyers were more active in December 2019. And what did this do to home prices? Well, the median home price uh, went up about 4.9% from December 2018 to December 2019. So now what does this mean for 2020? So now that we've crossed into this new decade and we're in 2020, uh, we wanted to give you guys some information as far as what we're seeing out there in the marketplace uh, lately. Um, we've been out there working with buyers and sellers often, and uh, one of the things that we've seen is uh, low inventory, as Robin had referenced, but also quite a bit of buyer activity. And uh, what we want to do is give you a little bit more information so that you can properly plan your buying experience this year um, to make it work the best for you. So if you're thinking about purchasing a home this year, um, maybe you have friends or family who has purchased a home here in the Denver metro area in the last few years, and maybe if they were in a competitive offer scenario, they ended up paying a premium uh, in order to get into that home because they're competing against other offers. However, it was okay because in the last few years, we've seen 10 to 12% annual appreciation on the home prices in this area. Um, so this is a little bit of a reality check time for home buyers. Yes, rates are low. It's still a good time to buy. Uh, however, if you are going to be in a competitive offer scenario, just think about how long do you want to stay in this home for? Uh, we recommend for our home buyers, our clients, that you should really think about this and it should at least be three to four years because uh, we don't expect to see this continued 10 to 12 percent appreciation in the coming years. Um, we expect to see probably the four to five percent what we've been seeing a little bit of a, a flattening out if you will on the market. So just think about that. The home that you're going to purchase this year uh, don't necessarily bank on that appreciation especially if you're paying a premium um, and think about how long you want to be staying in the home for. All right so Robin gave you that perspective from the buyer side of things and what I'm going to talk about with you now is um, what about you sellers out there? So when a seller hears that the inventory is very, very low, right away it says ding, ding, ding. Um, that's a great time to sell. And you're absolutely right. It is a great time to sell right now. Um, you know, especially if you're able to uh, get together with your local real estate professional. Hopefully it's us here at the Roots Home Sales Team. We want to put you in the driver's seat to not only get the best offer that you can and really capitalize on that investment that you've made in your home. But also, uh, many uh, uh, transactions have been seeing a lot of seller um, concessions throughout the inspection process. And with that, we can help you to um, properly prep your house, maybe take care of a couple little outstanding issues up front so that you're able to retain that full price offer that you've received instead of having to come back down off of that when inspection negotiations occur. So hopefully you found this information uh, helpful, whether you're a potential home buyer for 2020 or you're thinking about putting your home on the market this year, uh, do reach out to us. Even if it's just for advice, that's what we're here for. Um, we want to be that resource for you. And if you know somebody, please share this video with them if they're thinking about making this move. Um, we have a lot more information that we can dive into, um, but we kind of keep it on the surface for these videos just to not go too long. Um, and please follow us on our YouTube channel. It's The Roots in Denver Show. 
And then on Facebook, we're the Roots Home Sales team. And on Instagram, Roots underscore Home Sales. And until next time, stay, stay friendly, friendly, Denver. Denver.